para para bing bong para. There we go. Let's sort it there. I wonder if I move it a bit more. There we go. There we go. We're back in the horse pen, guys. Um, I'm just gonna go quickly. G'day, Hyperman. G'day guys, g'day Jason, Marco, Rye, how we doing guys, how are we doing, we're here with my friend again, but uh, just a little feed out of the trough aren't you, right, we've got two extra friends, just over here, they're just out of shot at the moment, excuse me Violet, can I sneak through here, you'd be great, no that's not for eating, Here. What are they saying, Violet? Can you read English? Or is that just a me thing? Thanks, personal hyperman. G'day, Justin. Welcome back. Thank you so much, guys. Um, we're painting the wedding photo again. So there's about two to three more layers to go on this one. This time around. We good, we good. Might be a little sneeze. We'll see. <coughs> we did have a sneeze. Um, this time around, you'll see here, we got a bunch of paint and gloss gel. So, we use the gloss gel so the texture that's currently in the work doesn't affect us too much. <laughs> yeah. G'day, Michaela. Um, Michael, sorry, Michael. Um, the gloss gel is gonna make the paint run nicer over the surface, rather than getting affected by the current textures we've got down. Yeah, turns out we do. Its name is Violet. It's not quite a unicorn, but I'm sure one day it could be one. I'm sorry, Violet. I can't fit everything in the frame in one big hit. Um, let me see here. If I look this up here, these are my other friends. We've got two little goats here. They're just hanging out. They're up to very, very little. G'day, Kate. Welcome. All right, let's go. Violet, don't eat the box. I can see what you're after. Who's in the no, 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 no. Violet, don't eat the box. Don't eat the box. Sorry guys, one second. Violet's, uh, oh my paint is on the other side of the fence there and Violet keeps trying to nibble on the paint. So put it down here under the canvas. Yeah, it's a good one. I did Adelaide, thank you very much. <clears throat> G'day guys. Is the live freezing for anyone else? Is it freezing, is it guys? It's niggly. I'll tell you what, what if I put over here? See if that improves it a wee bit. If I bring you right over here, and then I move the painting around a wee bit. That might work. But how's our, uh, how's our lighting? That's the question. I think our lighting's all good. Ooh, it's better there, isn't it? Um, anyway, we'll see how we get on. Alright, uh, should I move this around? Let me just, let me just take an inventory on lighting here, guys. We spin around here. It's not too bad. 
We spin around too. Ooh. Pain on my hand. Violet. Um, spin around here. That's just a wall though. We're probably best on that angle, guys. Probably best there. But, uh, I'll just bump that across to there. There we go. There, here we go. How are you doing? Happy days. I think that's the best angle we can do. We just have to miss out on the goats. They'll just hang out. An Arctic blast comes to New York City this weekend. That's wild. Watch out, there's a very large dog in front of you. That's actually a horse. How wild is that? A hungry, hungry horse. And then over here, we got some goats that are just hanging out. Likely that these characters are same with the other paintings. We might need another layer of liquid glass just to make sure it all pops. It's currently zero degrees here and the wind chill is negative 27. That's what? Violet. No, don't need the camera, Violet. Violet, we talked about this. Come here. Come here. Yeah, I know, I know. But if you use the camera, then it won't film. Cover me in sunshine. Cover me in good times. Violet is hungry. Violet is also the main character. This is all true. You're surprised no cats attack you today. Well, is that something that happens regularly to you? What you want? What you want? What you want? What you found me, mate? I know. Don't you bite me? Oh, I'm a bum. Don't let me leap up and miss my paint stroke. Violet is a pretty horse. Are you painting something or someone? Or just painting for fun? Uh, so this is something for someone. It's going to crush it. No, Violet, not in the paint. No tea, no tea. Um, this is a painting for a lady in Christchurch. And it's gonna be shipped on about the 9th of January, I reckon. So we've got another Two or three layers to go on it. The box that it goes inside is built. And I just need to make sure that I land as many good strokes as possible to make it as beautiful as possible. Capture a lot of energy in it, that's what we're after. Yeah. 
sunshine. Cover me in good times. Am I frozen? Again, I'm so sorry. Is it still frozen? A carrot. That sounds lovely. All I've got. And um, what if I go back like this? Okay. Just bring you a wee bit closer to the uh, whip. Did that improve it or are we still the same? It says a uh, good connection on my end. Let me try one thing, guys. It's TikTok, not me. I think it sounds like it's me. The connection's flattering here a wee bit. Hola, donde estas? Welcome, Benny. Um, let me just add a bit more of this color down. But I do like. I'm back. Okay. We'll see how that goes, John. See if that improves, but uh I'm to tell. Violet's replying to the comments. I think she is. I think that's highly likely. says hi. Who is the dark here to your right side? This one here or this one here? This is um, man, female, violet, two goats. I forget the name of the goats. One of them is called Sunny Bill, which is clearly because it's like Sunny Billy Goat. <clears throat> I'm in a stables. Fairly similar to a barn, but not a barn. Sound of a horse approaching is getting closer. One, two. G'day, Jack. Yes, this is a commission. So, putting it together layer by layer. Just a little piece at a time. You hungry, man? Or you? Yeah. Yeah, now you know what all the people's lost it. There we go. Both at once. need to take my back to New Zealand. <laughs> yeah, Violet's hanging out. Violet's happy girl.
How long do you need to... How long do you need for an image of size? Um, it's about eight to 10 layers. So if you give me three to four weeks, that's the best amount of time. Don't find my fingers. To finish a painting of this size. Um, the only wild card at the moment is Christmas and New Year's for shipping purposes, but uh, typically this size here, three to four weeks is about perfect for me. Plus that allows me a bit of space to do some things wrong because not every layer lands perfectly. So some layers may send me backwards a step. And if that's the case, I need a layer to send me forward a step. Um, yeah, these, these little goats tasting the side of it. Having a play. Having a play. Thanks for looking after them, Violet. Just a heads up, you dropped something on the ground. Maybe it was a uh, new, new hoo hoo. Maybe it was a paint, a little uh, food pellet for the goat. Lost it. Watch out, I got this. Yeah. While it's like, Sid ran off for a little bit, I'll handle the stream. <laughs> Honestly, buy a painting made by Violet. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, Violet's getting the hang of it. Violet's getting a one on one tutorial at the moment, so Violet gets the hang of things well. Hey, Violet. She probably even had a brush, to be honest. I got a little bit of paint on there. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Hi from Thailand. She's like, we're talking about what we're saying. Yeah. A little bit. A little bit. Bit of paint, I should do, shouldn't I? Horse's name is Violet. I'm painting a wedding shot at the moment. So it's a, a husband and a wife, newlyweds. And how old are you when you painted your first picture? Like two, two or one? But like all kids start painting around those sort of ages. What made you choose today's scenery? Well, my partner used to go ride a horse down the road. And so she's dropped me off here in the stables while she's doing that. 
with my job being to paint while she's gone. Which is pretty wholesome. So that's what I'm gonna do. That's pretty exciting, eh? Violet? No. No. <laughs> Violet, this is gonna eat you guys. What'd you do that for? What did you do that? Violet says hi. She said with a nose. She even scrolled on the screen there a little bit, which is pretty funny. Now this. Just seeing you guys. No. I know. Excuse me, one. Thank you. <clears throat> well, it's a little bit like that. <clears throat> Anyone else in your family can paint as well as you can? Uh, Mina, no. Just me. Well, maybe a few generations back, but not in the immediate family. G'day Steve, welcome back. Welcome back. Excuse me, oi, Zeb. Sorry Marco, I don't understand, but you seem very nice. Tuning. Oh no. Bye! Hee yeah. <laughs> hee, how's life in New Zealand? Lake Takapu is one of my favorite places. I've lived in Timaru six months. What a beautiful day there. Are you in New Zealand? Takapu is pretty cool. No, this is New Zealand. This is. This is. Auckland. Exactly where in Auckland, I just let Google Maps take me here. But, um, it, 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 find it. What you doing? Uh, 
Um, don't know where I am in New Zealand, I'll let Google Maps take me here. But uh, Born in Timaru, cool place, cool place. Hot water beach while there. I love hot water beach. You like hot water beach while? I think you do. Um, no, hot water beach is my favorite place. Hot water beach at Rotorua. It's a fantastic location. So, this painting here, it's on my face being pretty thick, but that's okay. Let's start making sure that when we land strokes on this face, we land them for where they're supposed to go. As this painting goes on further and further, it'll get less tolerant. Adding a little bit, you heard me yarn about it, a little bit of gesso in the face. Teeniest, tiniest little bit. Sorry guys. So I want to make this white horse into a unicorn. We could do. And your family from New Zealand? My family is from New Zealand. They are indeed. Is Violet little or is Seb just insanely tall? Violet's very little. Seb's not very big. I'm just a regular sized human. Kerry Bradshaw muted us for five minutes. Not cool. I was just saying I love the blonde highlights. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry about that. Um, hi, buddy, cute horses. Fantastic. And Michael, thanks for the finger hearts. Michael, thanks for the little crown. You're a champion. Is Santa going to find you this Christmas? He might do. He might do. I know what you want, Violet. I know. Violet's not behaving like it, but Violet did get fed. Huh. No worries, Marco. What hasn't been fed is the goats. Este hombre super... I don't know how to say that. Pebble? You want some? You can't see the goat, guys. He's just out of frame. The get go. Happy goat. Um, <clears throat> it's funny if you say that you're talking about the calendar because I... Um, Literally just ordered a calendar off a good friend. Um, so Kate Maxwell, who just started doing some photography, and the Kate Maxwell photography, asked me to put my calendar, and I said yes, and she sent one to me, and it's the most amazing calendar. So big thanks to Kate, because that is fantastic. playing around with a few things on the shop though so on the shop now you'll see that there is a uh Coming on through, Chief. 
on in. Thank you very much. Golden there. How long have you Violet. Um, how long have you been with Violet for? Literally just the last 30 minutes. Last 30 minutes. Do a happy girl. Hey Violet. You're all good. You're happy to be here. I'm happy to have you. Everyone's happy. Um, just put that in there. I'm just gonna tape this onto the back of it. Like this. I do get to owning animals. I don't own any animals. Um, Violet's not mine. Violet's not mine. This is a uh, little horse that's helping out. Hey, Violet. Yeah, I know. I know. Um, Webb turned into a horse. No. Elvis care. Hello. If I didn't saw the reference, I would think she's paddling through the earth. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that, but she's definitely not. It's a, yeah. We are gonna to swap to oil paints though, team. Oil paints, oh, no, we won't. We'll keep using this. So we're using acrylics on the canvas first, and then later on, in about 20 minutes or so, we'll swap to oils. And the reason we do that is so they don't mix beautifully separate. This whole character here is going to be oil. I know about it. Thanks, Jane. The most important part of this picture here, I think that's going to create the most depth, is going to be these, acryl uh, these texture down through the sea. Half the picture is the sea. We'll get her in proportions, but actually, it's going to be this glistening of water that made the biggest difference. That's what I reckon. Get a bit of paint on it. There we go. So, a little bit more paint. Sorry guys. Right, swap. We are now on oils. Bang. These are oils. They're a little bit different to acrylics. They'll sit better on this board. The board's soaking in too much of the uh, water and the uh, acrylics and drying out immediately. Um, so, I'm sorry Violet. I know you want to help. That's fair enough. I want you to help too. But you'll let me do this a little bit. So, get these oils on here. I know. 
and lift up a bit more, guys. And, uh, here's your mom. And jack it up a little bit higher. There we go. We don't need to reach the very top, but I do need to reach the bottom in my back. Can't quite do it. There we go. One and two. Perfect. Perfect. Now, g'day, Matt. How we doing? Um, can we see that artwork very clearly, guys? Uh, clear enough. That's all right. G'day, Mummy Bo. Welcome. Whose horse is that? That's my partner's parents' horse. Partner's parents' horse? His name's Violet. And Violet likes his painting. <clears throat> Violet, can I stand there? Would that be okay? I'd appreciate it. Thank you. There's a lot of grounding to a reference, which is hung there. But you don't get that same level of grounding from a you don't get that same level of grounding from a uh, image in your head. It's always good to two two two. Good morning, Cheryl. That's improved my day. How you doing, Cheryl? Welcome back. I'm in the uh, stables here in uh, Auckland. With Violet, again. Um, hope you're doing well, by the way. Do you only paint off a reference? Yes. Yes, see. Violet is a cutie. Salt, so do we? How old's Violet? Matt, I don't know. It's a good question. But I do not know. Um, just a wee bit high. Here we go. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. There we go. Let's put that where we want this picture to be. Now we're calling for it. Perfect. Thanks, Cheryl. Um, I'm doing good. Just popped in to say hi before I go do some small bits before Christmas. Yes, absolutely. Um, I tried to go down to the supermarket the other day. Before yesterday, and it was completely madness. I had to give up. So, good luck out there. Wish you all the best for your remainder, whether it was Christmas shopping or you're buying a little nicks and nacks here and there. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, it's wild out there right now. The Wild West.
What size canvas is that? I've never seen a vertical one like that before. That's because you're looking at something quite special. It's actually just a board. So this is a piece of wood, not even in the air. And this goes hand in hand with what I yarn about so often, guys. You don't need to buy fancy services to paint on. You can paint on literally anything. Because right now, we literally are. This is just an old piece of board. And that is all we need. So sometimes you get fancy canvases, sometimes you get fancy MDF boards and masonite and all these other things. But today, we're just using plain and simple, regular wood. Violet. No, 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 no. I know, I know. You're going to be a naughty horse, but you're not allowed. So cool, did you prep this wood before painting it? Victoria, welcome. Um, yes, I did. So to prep it, I did it the other day with you guys. Um, I put a transparent gesso coat on it. So the transparent gesso coat soaked into the wood, but it also stopped the wood from looking white like a regular gesso coat would. Just, um, just the transparent gesso would be able to paint on it while still keeping that woody look to it to make it look more candid and uh, wild. Because we want that. I know by the way you're looking at too. Sorry guys, I swear just that was a miracle paint. It's fantastic stuff. Nova. Oh, Nova, and I sent you a message back, Nova. Great pictures that you flicked me. Loved them. Um, second one, like I said in my little blurb to you, uh, I like the second one the most. I think it'll turn out the coolest in paint. It also leaves more of an opportunity to express yourself in that one. Big fan. <laughs> Thanks for the rain there, Nova. Um, so, hey, everyone, Merry Christmas, but I don't see you all, have an awesome, thank you very much, Cheryl, Merry Christmas to you too, um, I think you will though, uh, I'll be back on, well, whether you're online or not, I'll be here on, uh, probably Christmas Day and Christmas Eve, so, there we go, and Violet's been a little bit sassy right now, she wants to eat the paint, I'm telling you she can't.
talk to you about that one. Leave it. Merry Christmas, all you folks wants one of Yeah. Violet um she comes up and sniffs the painting, but she won't actually she won't uh, eat the paint or touch the canvas. She can smell that it's not food, but she wants to come up here and sort of give it a sniff. Just a double check, you know, because it's an interesting smell probably. It's like, hey, I haven't seen anything like that before, smell anything like that before. A little sniff and I'll be on my way. Yeah, good. How are you getting on? Just hanging out here with your animals. <laughs> I suppose we're doing that wedding commission, but uh, not quite coming together today, so I'll leave it for now. There's just a few things that are in the wrong place. I've been trying to shift them around, but when the paint gets too thick, <laughs> you get quite hard to move them. <laughs> so it'll come together though. Cool, thanks. All right, you're okay. Yeah, yeah so um, our cleaner will be here for a couple of hours about 10, but she's. As long as there's someone here to babysit me, Brent, that's the important thing. Yeah, so, so I don't go rogue. I'll leave her a note to make you a coffee and make you lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy and all. Uh, bye, Seb. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Okay, I'll catch you later too. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, guys. Um, I'll be here on Christmas and New Year's, but... Uh, yeah, wishing you guys all the best too. Wherever you are in the world, guys, I hope you have a good one. Because this is a special time of year. Not because there's anything about this time of year that's actually special, but because at this time of year, everyone pretends like it's special. And if everyone pretends like it's special, then it becomes special. And so it's pretty wholesome. New Year's a good time. Um, hello, Karen, welcome. I'm gonna mix this one a wee bit, guys. It's not my style. It ain't my style. I don't care. Yeah, it's not my style to mix, but we're gonna mix it. I'll do anything with you anywhere. She got me in the palm of your hand, girl. You okay, Violet? Let me just sneak over here. She got me in the palm of your hand, girl. I don't dance. Here I am. Spinning you round and round in circles. It ain't my style. I don't care. I'll do anything with you anywhere. Yes, you got me in the palm of your hand, girl. I don't think here I am spinning you round and round in circles. Sorry guys, got some leaf fries stuck in my head. Ain't my style. I don't care. I do anything with you anywhere. Yes, you got me in the palm of your hand, girl. You're okay, Violet. That was pretty naughty. There we go. In the right spot there. Put oh, back this way a little bit. Uh, we're working on two paintings. So we've got a wedding shot, which I'm just leaving for a little bit, just to let it dry. See where it gets to. 
and we're gonna come back to it. And this is the other shot, this is on a board. So this is our relaxed shot. You just though, don't you kick that over on me. Yes, you got me in the palm of your hand, girls. I don't think here I am. Spinning you round and round in circles. It ain't my style. I don't care. I'd do anything with you anywhere. If you got me in the palm of your hand, girl. I don't dance. Here I am. Spinning you round and round in circles. It ain't my style. I don't care. I'd do anything. Do you ever do abstract art? Milton, yes. In fact, pretty much all my art's abstract. I think that's a fair assumption. Probably more, you should call it impressionist, but abstract, yeah. It's never realism, I'll say that much. Colors look fab, thank you so much. It's more monochrome than I usually do, but I like it. Um, tried painting acoustic guitar serenade us with a wonderful voice but until then you just stuck with me acapella so love what you get guys it ain't my style i don't care i'd do anything with you anywhere here if you got me in on your shelby got some bad news Violet, uh, came up with two flags coming out the gate and got some paint on her face. <laughs> <laughs> and she's white, so it shows. Oh, nice to meet you. And they quickly lost interest. Oh yeah. But, uh, I guess you're repetitive, hey? Yeah. Old Violet, she she she's great. She keeps trying things the whole time. Dude, you're so trusting to have it in there with you. Yeah, no, Violet, Violet's all good. The, the ones oh Violet, you touch the paint with your nose as well. What are you doing? She's very trusting, obviously. <laughs> um Violet's really cool though. Violet's cool. But uh, that's because she keeps trying cheeky things. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. See that little cardboard box there? If you don't watch her for long enough, she'll come across and start trying to bite the box. Just in case there's treats or something. Yeah, well, she knows there are treats around here somewhere. Treats. Okay. Are they guns? She can eat them. I know, but she's already been fed this morning. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Naughty she bite. She's not a feeder, hey? What's that? She's not a feeder. Oh, no, I'll feed her, but um, Wendy said she's had enough. You, you're a mess. Brent's not gonna be happy with me. No, you won't care. You won't care? You Should I just paint the whole horse? Okay. Wendy, look, I made some art. You need a chalk hat. Right, picture of chalk. Um, Violet looked over the camera once. <laughs> yeah, she had a little tussle with a goat, leapt up, and the uh, camera went flying. <laughs> Pretty entertaining. Is it still live at the moment? Yes, it is. Oh. Sorry guys, I'm just saying hi to a few people. Um, there's only 53 people here. That's all right. That's the one. Do it. What's the uh, go? We're out of here in 40 minutes? Yeah. You just... Well, it's, it's the Violet Show. Everyone's been saying it on the stream. <laughs> What's that, sorry? I'm going to teach you to paint. Uh, people have been saying they would uh, like a, a Violet painting. Totally. I yeah. She bites the brush. Yeah, she's, she's more of an eater. Yeah, yeah. You need to like tape it to her head like a unicorn. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. And then put like cardboard down below the canvas so while she's chewing on the cardboard, the paintbrush is like dawdling away.
Thanks, guys. Violet wants to become one of your paintings, that's why. Violet wants to be painted, apparently. Oh. Yeah. One day, Violet, when you're famous. Was that you guys riding down the uh, street before? No, it was just another horse going flippity clop. Mm -hmm. Okay. That one's, uh, yeah, still in its infancy, but it's coming along. I love it. It looks really nice. Funky. Yeah, it's super cool. Mm. Still in its infancy. It looks finished for me. You're the best. You can hang around. <laughs> Violet's already famous. Thanks, Victoria. Violet's doing her best. Violet's got paint on her face, and I need to get rid of it. But I don't think Violet's gonna like having her face rubbed for tips, so it might be staying. <laughs> Wait, is this acrylic? Uh, that's oil. Oh, oil. Oh, yeah. Wait, so, it's, so, bad? so you want to rub it with a cloth? Yeah. Wet. And then, or dry. yeah. Oh. Go for wet. See what happens. Okay. Violet. Hello from Mexico. I know that I know that you've got something. Oh, it's there, it's stuck. That paint's really on there. Nah, it's coming off. It's coming off? Yeah. Okay. A little scratch. And her whole head's gonna be blue. My lord. <laughs> Shelby Cooper. <laughs> The initial blob's on me, but that's... <laughs> I don't know about that. Maybe she needs like a little Vaseline on before she paints. Yeah. A little coating. Oh no, it's going on her neck. I'm making it worse. It's so much worse. <laughs> <laughs> oh my sweet lord. Um, do you have some... Uh... We can... Alcohol? We'll play with a few things. Um, yeah, that would work. Mm. That would work perfectly. Got some red wine. No, that's exactly the wrong kind of alcohol. <laughs> we don't need like a red and blue. <laughs> Christmas, it's red and green is the vibe, but um, some rubbing alcohol or something. Yes, indeed. Because then you can use that to clean a wound, so it's not going to be bad for her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it'll, rubbing alcohol will fix it almost immediately. Sorry. Looks like she's got a little bit. Hey, little unicorn. Are you little unicorn? You're so cute. Sorry. <laughs> hey, buddy. Mum's gonna come back and be like, um, excuse me, what happened? I've already had one slip today. What? Uh, your mum gave me a coffee. Yeah. And a mug that you gave her. Yeah. Oh, no, you know. And I put it on the little bench here while yeah. I was doing some paint, you know. Violet's really looking at me. <laughs> oh, we've packed it up now, but it was a nice mug. Yeah, that's why she brought it back the middle one. Oops. Which should have come the first time, probably. <laughs> Hindsight 20. I guess you live and learn, right? Yeah, we do, we do. Which mug? <laughs> what did it look like? You like, guys are going to the nicest first fight. <laughs> imagine the nicest mug you've given your mother, and that was the one that broke. I can't remember. Your mother brought it out very proudly and said, this one was given to me by Shelby. Oh no. <laughs> Two minutes later. <laughs> oh dear. That's pretty funny. That was pretty funny. Yeah, that was shocking. And she's like, oh, well, you know, you need to be a horse person. You know where to put your cuppy. So now that's my little shelf over there where I put the cuppy. On that, behind that bar. It's like safe. With the scrubbing brushes. Oh yeah. So I felt very silly. That was pretty silly. It's pretty silly. Yeah. Hey, you've got paint on the pony. So now she's like, Sid was up here for an hour and a half. My horse is now blue, and my favourite mud is smashed. <laughs> Just two strikes. I think you got one more in I your. Got hour. one more. Yeah, yeah. perfect. She just bit me. Damn. She looks so cute, innocent. She is super cute. She's oh. like. Speaking of alcohol, bro. Mm. The sooner you do it, the better it'll be. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like not wanting to panic you or anything, but it'd be really cool if I say that's like, dying. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. yeah, good effort. Mm -hmm. You don't have any like um, you know, wound cleaner? Yeah. That'll work for treat.
<clears throat> with soap, no Victoria. With uh, these sort of paints, you need to get like a uh, turpentine, or in this case, we use a wound scrub. So slightly higher alcohol content, and the solvent removes the paint. That's what works the best. And God knows, horse needs it. <laughs> Thanks, Celeste. Um, yes, Kiwi accent to listen to. At the moment, there's no moderators on, but uh, there's only a few of us, there's only 33, so I'll moderate. Um. That's what Violet is for, that is correct. That is 100% correct. Violet is today's moderator. Um, this is one we've just been throwing a bit of paint on, just loosening up on. Um, it's not trying to be anything. It's a lady on a paddle board. Um, the picture itself is important, but um, the painting we're making is just a relaxed painting. Just a very relaxed painting. Just wants to capture that water nice and fun. Wants to, yeah, not try and be too much of anything. Just be fun painting.
Is this commission painting or not? Jason, it's not. And uh, Matt, plans for Christmas Day. I'll be in uh, Tauranga. And we'll be going live, doing a few commissions there too, for a bit of fun. Um, I've got a commission piece just behind me. But I just need to loosen up my paint strokes for a little bit. My hand's just a little bit tight, needs to relax. Hope she doesn't get fired. <laughs> I'm not sure who's getting fired, but I hope she doesn't either. It seems Vi has been slacking off on the job. She isn't getting enough carrots. Yes. Yes, all these things are true. She's had too many carrots. Pushing Shelby in the path of danger? Well, I told her the shark story because she was asking how big he was and what you guys, the most faithful friend. friend. Mm. Okay, so I found some hand sanitizer. Oh, that might work. It's got a lot of alcohol in it. We're we looking for alcohol? Yeah, we are looking for alcohol. Mmm, smells good, hey, Piney. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's working. It's working. I'm sorry, baby, it's going to be stringy. It's just a nice, cool, fresh feeling. Yeah. <laughs> a cool, minty, fresh feeling. That's it. Just well, reframe well, it. You want to be an artist, Violet? This is what happens. No pain, no gain. You've got to be committed to suffering to be a true artist, right? Mm -hmm. That's what they say. <laughs> Does anyone want to warn Violet about Wait, I'm not going to be in the stream. <laughs> <laughs> You're in the stream, Shelby. <laughs> <clears throat> love how Violet knows to stand directly in front of the camera because she can probably see the light of it, I reckon. And the accent is New Zealand. New Zealander accent. New Zealand. Thank you very much, Matt. You're an absolute. Jason would be at the keyboard going, fuck, see. Super language. <clears throat> Every time I comment, he always misses my comments. I'm sure he'll just wait and tell you in person, surely. No, one time I needed the ingredients for um, something. I can't remember, it's something art related? No, something food related. Maybe he just knows his audience. No, true. Good point. Good point. Okay, this is a very blue pony. I think it's working though. Yeah, I think so, but this I is... think, yeah, you've, you've definitely made a bit of a mess, but the only way to get through this <laughs> You've definitely made a bit of a mess, is that... That's the language he's going for. What's that? That I've made the mess. Well, I feel like it was a small dot. Before. It was not a small dot. I feel like. No. I feel like in no. hindsight. Did I, I add more paint to it? I feel like you spread it pretty thickly. No, I think. Like, I think this is our first spot. Oh, I'm there was a dot of paint like this much, and then you're like, oh, 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 I look back and it's like this much. <laughs> <laughs> 
There's a definite spread there. It's definitely more noticeable now because it's covering more ground, but it's not obviously more pain. No. I Maybe it needed a little scrape pain. off before it got a little smush around. That's it's on my side. That's two yeah. on the tip side. Last time I checked, it was uh, Shelby who actually looked painful. <laughs> Good try. I've already texted Wendy and told her that's the case. Alright, you might break it. It's just the same thing. Like, uh, that's what I said. I said, Shelby's so angry about me getting her mug so smashed. I took it out that she threw pocket. a paintbrush at me and it hit wild. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's actually a really good lie. Come <laughs> on. Well, I'm nothing but confused right now. Why, why is a strange man putting color on service and why does everyone keep rubbing my face? She deals with little children. I think this is like all the, you know, normal day for her, hey? Thanks, Augustin. You're a champion. Um, at oh, this so point, just it. paint her entirely blue. <laughs> <laughs> is it Violet's voice we hear? No, it's Shelby's voice. We've got two people here. Look at that. You want to say hi, guys? No. Too late. There you go. Hi. This is not how you make friends, then. Yeah. I'm to do that with how many friends are on there, so. Do you have any tips for an artist? Greer, if you're an artist, you don't need my tips. Stay in the stream, Shelby, you'll be fine. It's all about me. You're right, it's not about you. How's it looking, Shelves? Blue. Blue. I feel like the real art's happening over there at the moment with the horse, right? Shit. Is it working? <laughs> <laughs> it's not. It is not working. Holy oh, heck. We got some work to do there. Um, we need to leave at 10, don't we? Yeah. All right, guys, I have to disappear because I need to pack up here and then I am going to, yes, you're right, Matt. It's all Shelby's fault. Surely it's not mine. Kidding, it's definitely mine. Um, <laughs> uh, Victoria says, poor Violet. She's turning into a smooth. <laughs> all right, guys. I'm gonna disappear, but I'll be back probably Christmas Eve and we'll slap some more paint on these canvases and hopefully that one there. All the best and Merry Christmas Eve Eve and I will see you all on the next one. Cheers guys, bye.